It's a torrid struggle. The Montreal Habs are ahead by one goal, just seconds away from winning the cup. Their hopes rest on rookie goaltender Jake the Snake. His proud family cheers him on from the stands. Gee, I wish I was as talented as Jacob. We're so lucky to have him for a little brother. Shapiro coming at ya! Ah! Followed by a bullet from Boom Boom O'Toole. Uh, come on guys, not so hard. Don't hit me. You're too <laughs> little to play hockey. I'm not too little. I'm not too little. I'm the goalie on my school team. You can stop a beach ball in slow motion. Come along, Boom Boom. Let's find a real goalie to practice with. By all means, Slapshot. I'll be a good goalie. You'll see. You'll see. No! Huh. for the dreary Meadows Maroons, because no one else wanted the job. And the equipment fit me. Sort of. Whoa! Good try, Jacob. You almost actually touched that one. Yeah, nice one, Bipsqueak. <laughs> <laughs> Jacob Boo Boo. Thanks, Buford. You're playing great, too. I know! I've only fallen down 14 times so far. 15! Our team sure needed help. We were halfway through the season, and we hadn't won a game yet. We hadn't even scored a single goal. player couldn't seem to score. Man, we suck. Whoa, that was fun! Why the long faces? You're only down ten goals after the first period. Coach Louse is right. You can still come back. <laughs> Maybe if you spend more time coaching and less time plunging toilets. What was that, Missy? If I didn't think Mr. Laus could coach you ungrateful monsters and keep the school's toilets unclogged, I wouldn't have entrusted him with both jobs. It ain't my fault you're so lousy. <laughs> it would help if we had decent equipment. What? What did you say? Buford's playing with a broken hockey stick. A broken stick! And Renee's using magazines for shin pads. C'est vrai! A new uniform wouldn't hurt either. New stuff now. New stuff now. 
<clears throat> I promise to buy you a couple of sticks and maybe some shin pads if you can win a game. Thanks, Principal <gasps> Greedy Guts. That's very generous of you. <clears throat> That's one promise I won't have to keep, right, Laos? No, sir, boss. Yeah, I don't trust that brat Tutu. I'm turning a tidy profit charging all the mommies and daddies to watch their useless kids play. And I've almost saved enough to build myself a heated box seat. So the last thing I want to do is waste my money on those brats. Don't worry. It'll take a miracle for this team to win. <laughs> I can't believe it. 36 to nothing. That must be the worst score ever in the whole history of hockey. But it sure was exciting. The whistles, the cheering crowd, the goals, the hot dogs. <sighs> I love hockey. We're never gonna win a game. Leo's right. We're lousy. Things could be worse. Hey, it's that sieve from the morons. See? It's not morons, it's maroons. You're the morons. Oops. Hey! Ha! <laughs> you missed! You missed! Oh. <laughs> you must be the worst goalie in the whole world, Jacob, Jacob Boo Hoo. <laughs> you might not be the actual worst goalie in the whole world. Maybe just the worst in Montreal. And that's not so bad. Well, I'm gonna show those guys. I'm gonna become a great goalie. All I need is practice. Lots of practice. La 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 la. La 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 Sweet! Hey, that's quite a glove hand you're getting there. Reminds me of another big league goalie I know. A Gummer Gormley rookie card, signed in everything. Yeah, I picked it up at Lardy's Cards and Collectibles. It's for you because you've been working so hard. Thanks, Dad. Practice makes perfect. Who's this gummy guy? Gummer Gormley, the greatest goalie the Montreal Habs ever had. Work hard, good luck, the Gummer. Good luck? My luck's gonna change now. Oh, and Jake, could you shovel the walk, please? See ya! <laughs> what are you so happy about? We're about to be slaughtered. Again. No, we're not. We're gonna win. And you wanna know why? Because Jacob's got a lucky gummy card. That's why. Gummer Buford. It's signed by Gummer Gorman. See? Zit. We'll need more than a silly card to win this game, Pee-wee. Yeah. That's for sure. Yeah. Some save! Your lucky card! I don't believe it! Cool! Wow! Allons-y! Maybe we can win! Yay! What are those little finks up to? Did not! 
did too. You said if we won a game, you'd buy us some new equipment. And we won, fair and square. That was a fluke. It doesn't count. Who says? Me. Stamp it. No rubouts. Wait till I tell my dad. He heard you make that promise, and he told all the other parents about it. He did? Tell you what, if you win your next game, I'll buy the team all the new equipment it needs. And new uniforms, too? <sighs> and new uniforms, too. Nice move on the uniform, but we still have to win another game. No problem. Ah, bien sûr, the lucky card. We can't lose with Jacob's lucky card. Lucky card, eh? <laughs> Leo, great game today. It was? <laughs> of course. Oh, except for that one part where you won. I had to make a new promise to wiggle out of the old one. They can't win again. Got it? Sure, sure. Uh, listen, I know why they won today. That 2-2 two -two brat is a lucky hockey card. Really? Then get out there and bring me that card. What are you doing here? I forgot my school bag. What are you doing here? What's it look like I'm doing? Nothing. Well, that's what I'm doing. Can a guy do nothing around here? It looks like someone's luck is about to change. <laughs> oh no! I can't find my lucky card. Someone stole it. Someone stole it. Who'd want to do that? Someone who wants to see us lose. I know. My dad. Your dad? Sure. He says losing builds character. I was thinking Leo Laos. Now, that's just plain disgusting. These tea bags are still perfectly good. That was quite the lucky find. This baby really does work. Follow him? We don't have to. Leo didn't pat his pocket before he left, so I bet my card's still in his office. <gasps> this might take longer than I thought. You found the card and didn't bring it to me? Oh, you wanted it now? Of course I wanted it now. The game's tonight. Where is it? In my desk. What are you gonna do with it? <gasps> it really works, you know? That's why I have to do this. Ah, let's see Tutu and his team of misfits win now. Uh, now we'll just be a lousy goalie again. Hey, Squirt, we just won our game, as usual, and I got a hat trick. We're coming to your game tonight. Are you nervous? We'll be there jeering you on. <laughs> <laughs> what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? 
Too bad you don't have another card, huh? Good idea, Buford. Come on. Thanks. My mom says I'm full of good ideas. She told me she can't believe what goes on in my head sometimes. Where are we going? We're going to buy a new car down at Lardy's. That is a good idea. Uh, sorry, some old geezer bought my last Gummer card on the weekend. Sounds like your dad. My dad says Gummer comes in to sign cards. Does he live near here? Sure, just around the corner, number 47. Maybe he's not home. Or maybe he's had a household accident. It's well documented that four out of five accidents occur in the home. All right, all right, keep that shot Whatever you're I ain't fine. Does Gummer Gormley live here? Does he live here? <laughs> <gasps> sure he lives here. Come on in, fellas. But you better let me go first. What's wrong, mister? I keep the house sort of booby trapped so as I can keep in practice. <laughs> Give us a hand here, will you, boys? <laughs> oh, thanks. <gasps> You're Gummer Gormley. <laughs> Clever little whippersnapper, aren't ya? What happened to your teeth? Why do you think they call me Gummer? My teeth got knocked clean out of my head by flying pucks. We didn't wear face masks back then, you know. Probably would have been a good idea. Sit down, fellas, and tell me what you want for old Gummer. And then he tore it into a gazillion pieces. That's why I need a new card. Yeah, or he'll stink out the joint. Road apples! I'm not giving you a new card! Why not? Cause it sounds to me like you're expecting that card to do your work for you. Luck doesn't win games, hard work does. That's why I sign every card. Work hard! The good luck part's just me being nice. Didn't you ever have a good luck charm? I had a lucky jock strap once. Never took it off. But I knew it didn't win me any games. Well, you better get going. You want to make your game. Thanks, Mr. Gormley. Bye, Mr. Gummy. Back up. You'll do fine. No! <laughs> Hurry up, or we'll miss the game. Huh. Without my lucky card, maybe that's not such a bad idea. Come on, Choo Choo. The team needs you. And we need you too, Jacob Boo Boo. Yeah, for target practice. <laughs> hey! Uh, look out! Yeah! Oh. How did you do that? That was outstanding! And I did it without my card. Are you crazy? We can't win without that card. We might as well just pack up and go home right now. We don't need it, guys. It's just a hunk of cardboard. We won last game because we were good enough to win. And because we scored more goals than the other team. Coach Laos is wrong. We aren't lousy. We played great in our last game, and we can play great again. Allons-y. Let's go, Maroon. <laughs> Yeah! 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 
Only a few more seconds to go. Up, bib squeak. Okay, okay. Principal Greedy Guts, about uh, those promises you made. Oh. So we won, and Greedy Guts kept his promise, but he still got the last laugh. Renee doesn't mind though. She says the new sweaters inspire her. Hey! No shooting at my face! Jake the Snake here with... Gabbergorn Blaze Cody Tips. When someone comes in on you, be sure to cut down the angle. That means coming out of your crease to cover more of the neck. Gotcha! Only, don't come out too far. The best way to guard the lower half of the net is with the butterfly. Just let your pads slide to the side like so. Make the save. Then pop, rock, up. <laughs> well, it used to be easy. And remember, always wear your helmets, masks, and face cards. Or you'll wind up looking like me! <laughs> 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 <laughs>